Google right. had a live demo of yes. these glasses. They've got Samsung working with them. It's called Android XR. You were a big Google Glass fan, Mike. Uh, yep. This is the next generation. It's return of the glass holes. You know. <laughs> uh, we're coming back. Heads up display the using a laser projection. As you're walking around, it will show you how, uh, directions on the mm -hmm. on the glasses. When you look down to, to make sure you don't step into a manhole, open manhole, <laughs> you'll still see the directions. You'll still see an open manhole. And it's pretty great. But really what, what, what we're getting to, the, the easiest prediction to make in technology and has been for like three years, is that we're all headed for a world in which... Lots of pe billion, a, a billion people will be wearing glasses that are connected to AI, and you'll have what Google is now describing as a universal assistant. It's basically an AI chatbot that's agentic, that knows who you are, that knows your preferences, knows what you've done, knows how you talk, knows everything about you, and will help you and guide you and give you advice and make sure you don't step into manholes. That's the key, right? That's the thing that it, all of a sudden in the next five years this is the this is the new hotness in hardware it's the fact that ai has actually made uh smart glasses a, a reasonable proposition at this point exactly especially with agentic uh, i'm sorry multimodal ai which is what google's getting at here and which will be perfectly universal